That's right, two ultimate hybrids in one episode. You guys are spoiled rotten. Hello, once again, Crustaceans. My name is Mustard, and today we're back in the world of Feed uh, the Beast. Now, hey, okay, so I haven't, uh, I haven't been able to do videos for a couple days. Uh, Tuesday, I just wasn't feeling very good, so uh, I figured if I forced out a video, it'd be pretty cruddy. And yesterday, Time Warner was having some issues, and I was having issues connecting to the server, so I couldn't do a video. So, uh, I was pretty upset about that. Um, like, I could connect for like 10 minutes, and then I'd get kicked off, and my internet would go off for like 20 minutes. So, uh, yeah, thanks, Time Warner. That was nice of you. Anyway, um, so we're back in the world of Feed the Beast. Uh, what I did yesterday when I tried doing a video. Um, is I worked on this world here, which is a charged world, Eternal Storm, and I have a lightning rod here. And let me tell you, this lightning rod is awesome when it generates electricity. Um, there's a chicken down here. Hi, chicken. Um, basically what happens is lightning strikes this big iron fence thing here that I went up to the sky limit with, and it powers all of these um, and it generates I think a hundred thousand EU per lightning strike it's either a hundred thousand or a hundred million I don't really remember uh, but it's a it's a huge amount of EU and basically it just goes into my storage so yup I actually I I do need it I found that out um, after the video with the matter fabricator, I actually uh, rearranged our power system back here. Let me just get over here quick. Um, I actually redid the power system, so it's all of these going into all four sides from one side, uh, like this. And. Uh, this drains power, let me tell you. Our, our battery was actually starting to take some hits there. Um, so, basically, we've got a ton of power going in here. And I've had the, the uh, matter fabricator running for a couple days. I don't plan on turning it off ever, but um, we have a 926 uh, iridium, or iridium, UU matter. <laughs> Iridium, that'd be crazy. Uh, so we got that much UU matter, and what I'm gonna do today is I'm going to build a solar panel, ultimate hybrid style. Um, and I actually already have the recipe in here, and I've actually already made one because I wanted to test it uh, with some of the things that uh, it has. So let's try this out. Let's do ultimate hybrid solar panel. Let's auto craft this beast and let's see how it does. So it's gonna slow down around this part because it has to flatten out some uranium and then it has to uh, do these compressed coal balls as well. Um, but yeah, right now I think it's flattening out uranium because uh, I have all my uranium stored as dust. So it has to actually compress it, then bring it back, and then do whatever it has to do with it. it. Looks like it's almost done. It's just working on flattening out the uranium. Flattening out uranium, flattening out uranium. Boop, 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 boop. There we go, cool. So, ultimate, we have an ultimate hybrid solar panel. Boom! Um, like I said, I've already crafted this uh, once. Actually, it might have been twice. I don't remember. I crafted one or two of them because we were having issues with power and I needed some fast power, so... Sorry. But... <laughs> I'll show you where our little solar farm is. It's over here. Uh, looks like I already crafted two and I had a hybrid already. So we're gonna throw that on there and now we have three ultimate hybrids that are helping with power. Um, and like I said, we need this because 
uh, those matter fabricators eat electricity. And uh, I basically want to get it so that the, uh, oops, the matter fabricators aren't draining these because, um, let's see if I can find an empty one because we have actually quite a few empty MFSUs that aren't filling because they, uh, they're just on the border of uh, staying. And it looks like this one was actually starting to drain a little bit too because this one was full earlier today uh, before I reset the quarries. But uh, yeah, so basically it just comes in here and it goes over to there. Um, and then we do have some coming off of these but it's not a lot because these aren't on for some reason I don't know like for some reason my spot loader is not spot loading in the in the lava world so I think that's something we're gonna take a look at real quick um, let's see nether and stone lava so in the lava world here I have two pumps over here and that one's still going. There's no reason they shouldn't be working. Uh, let's hit F9 a couple times. Okay, so there's the chunk boundaries. We're not on a chunk boundary. Let's see. We're going to just move the spot loader real quick. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe it's just being a dingus. Um... Looks like this area is almost done as well. Uh, yeah, it probably is. Alright. Let's just move this now and get it over with. Doop. Doop, doop, doop. Oh yeah, let's hit F9 twice. There we go. Okay. So... We're going to move this. I think we're going to head this way this time. Um, I wonder if we can find a little island or something to base ourselves off of. Oh, there's an island. Oops. That's lava. Lava. Hot. Yes, I know I'm burning. Thank you. Alright. We're gonna move this thing. Ah, crap, crap, get out of the lava. Let's eat so we don't die. There we go. Alright. So we're gonna turn this off. Alright. And we're gonna head this way a little bit. Um, I want to get away from this island a little uh, just because I think that the lava is not going to be as deep near the island. Um, I want to get it as deep as possible and I think somewhere right about here is probably good. So let's throw both these pumps down. I have two pumps because uh, we actually use quite a bit um, of lava, so I just do it this way because it's easier. I should probably spread the pumps out some more if I really want max efficiency, but I don't really care about that. I just want some lava. Uh, send only to lava, there we go. Receive only from IC2 power. Receive only from IC2 power. So that should start pumping. I don't know why this one's not pumping. Unless it is and I just don't see it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, stop jumping around. IC2 power, receive only. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe 
maybe this one's just not working because it's too close. I don't know. Alright, well, we'll leave this here. Let's do lava. Two. Sure, that works. Alright, let's head back to the portal. Um, I've been having a lot of issues with the lava stuff, so I'm kind of glad that I, I moved away from that a little bit. Uh, eventually, I think I want to remove the lava systems because they're kind of obsolete now. I mean, they're decent, but they're not generating tons and tons of power uh, because it's lava, so... Um, I don't know. I want to get a little bit more invested in solar. Uh, solar is not my favorite form of energy. I don't really like it that much, mainly because it's kind of boring. But uh, it's better than lava by far. I mean no arguing that so all right let's go downstairs here so uh, I went through the comments on my last video and a lot of people were like hey crusty you should put all different kinds of armor and you should put what uh, makes them up what like what the uh, main ingredient of the armor is in for like the thing above it so I like that idea so we're gonna do that do iridium we'll do a uh, carbon fiber plate do iron we'll do leather I have one million leather I don't think I'm, I'm hurting for leather now. So we got all those. Alright. Cool. We got that, 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 and that. We're going to go here. We're going to throw that there. And iridium plate. We got the carbon fiber plate. We got the iron. We got the leather. Cool, I like it. Um, we do have to finish this, um, the gravity chest plate, and we also need to fix the nano thing because I did not put an advanced solar helmet on there. So we're gonna do that real quick. Uh, this shouldn't take us too long because we have a lot of material. So I haven't even messed with the your UU matter, the UU yet. Um, all right, so let's take a look at solar helmets. So the ultimate hybrid solar helmet, uh, the ultimate solar, there we go. So we need an HV transformer, the quantum suit helmet, circuits, glass fiber cables, and an ultimate hybrid. Or we can just take a hybrid solar helmet and an ultimate hybrid, and that makes ultimate solar helmet. Wait, there's a hybrid solar helmet? I didn't even know that. That's cool. Alright. Ultimate solar helmet becomes an ultimate solar helmet. Uh, Alright. Okay. So, um... We need to make the quantum one. We need some iridium plates. Uh, I'm gonna have to make some more, actually. Let's do this. Let's craft... Um... 32 iridium. So that went straight to our uh, compressor. So that's compressing. Let's see how much of a dent we made. Oh, that's not bad. 150-ish. Thirty-two. All right, thirty-two. And then we need some diamond dust, and we need. Um, advanced alloy plates. Alright. So let's throw these in here. Let's see, what do we got for iridium? We can do nine. That should be enough. Ok, 
Okay, so that's gonna go. Uh, while we're waiting, let's um, oops. throw those back in there. Let's take a look at the advanced solar helmet, which is an advanced solar panel, low voltage transformer, gold cable, advanced circuit. All right, so let's make an advanced solar panel. We got our advanced solar panel. We got the nano helmet. What else do we need? We need gold cable, advanced circuit, low voltage transformer. LV. Oh, cool. Gold. 2X insulated. And then we need advanced circuits. There we go. Go. All right, let's auto craft this beast. All right, throw that in there. Oh, also, while I'm in here, um, someone told me that the reason these are red is because they don't work anymore. Uh, that's actually not true. All of these are minium stone recipes and the system doesn't recognize them so it automatically thinks that they're, they don't work but they do actually work. That's why I keep them around. Um, the blaze rod is also the same thing. It's uh, two blaze powder with one minium stone. It, because uh, sometimes you get that glitch where the minium stone doesn't show what actually is being crafted that's actually what happens with uh, all of those recipes so it does actually work it just uh, it, it's a glitch I guess okay advanced solar helmet click BAM look at that perfect oops I threw it on the ground alright so let's go throw this up with all our other stuff Look at that. Bam! That is the ultimate quantum suit right there. Or nano suit, I should say. Uh, we have the advanced solar helmet, advanced nano chest plate, uh, and the nano suit legs and boots. And now we're going to do the gravit chest plate, the ultimate hybrid solar helmet, uh, the quantum leggings, and the quantum boots. But we're going to need more iridium plates, I just realized. Because I forgot that the whole thing takes iridium plates. Uh, oh, crusty nub. Alright. So let's just make 64 iridium. Uh, we'll work with that for now. Uh, let's craft the easy stuff first. The leggings and the boots. So, boots. Wall jumping upgrade. Well, alright. So we need rubber boots, laptron crystal, nano suit boots, iridium plates. Okay. So rubber boots are, I don't, I forgot how to make those. Let's see, rubber and then some wool. Okay, well. Auto craft those then. All right, so we got the rubber boots. Let's make one pair of them because we only need one right now. We need the iridium plates, we need a lapatron crystal. Oh, we actually have one. And then we need uh, the, 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 the nano boots. Nano. And I do have to say, a lot of people have been asking me why I have certain things uh, auto crafted. Really, it's I, I usually auto craft all the recipes just because I don't want to have to make them again. Uh, because a lot of the recipes require things. Like someone asked me on my one of my more recent videos, why do you have bows auto crafted? And I'm like, well, because dispensers need them and some other things need them. So I, I usually just auto craft stuff because it's way easier. I just type it in and it goes, hey, look, I got this. So um, yeah, I don't know. I just. I like to be able to 
just have everything done, I guess. I don't know if that makes any sense. Oops. Iridium plates. Okay, so 64 we can make 16. Um, advanced alloy plates. Oh crap, we're running out. Make a butt ton of them quick. Um, so right now, yeah, it's, it's sending it to this compressor, I believe. Yeah. Um, and it does go rather quickly with four overclockers and everything, but eh, it's still pretty slow. I don't know, I'm all about, like, go super fast. Okay, we need diamond dust as well. Diamond. I need to make more of that soon, too. Not that it's gonna kill me. There we go, alright. Let's throw these in here. Oh, we actually had quite a few left over. Um, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Alright, remind me to click that later. <laughs> like I can hear you. Remind me. Alright. Leggings. Do the quantum suit leggings. We need machine blocks, laptron crystals, nano suit, glowstone, iridium. Let's make the leggings real quick because they're pretty easy. We need machine blocks. We need glowstone dust and a lapatron crystal alright so lapatron crystal, machine blocks, nano suit those and iridium plates that's a bealizer alright bam we got that cool Let's throw those in there. Let's make our boots. Let's make our leggings. Alright. So we got these guys. Uh, we gotta go charge them up. So we can put them on the, the rack. Oh boy, this is going to take a while. Alright, so... Alright, we'll come back to those in a second. Um, now, we need the helmet. The helmet is going to be a little bit harder. Mainly, this is the ultimate hybrid solar. The ultimate solar, yeah. Uh, so we need a quantum suit helmet, a nano suit, laptron crystal, reinforced glass, advanced circuit, iridium plate, laptron, reinforced advanced circuit, iridium plate, right. advanced circuit, lap, otron crystal. Reinforced glass and the nano helmet. I think this is how it went, but I'm not entirely sure. Hey, it is. Wow. I'm good. I'm good. Alright. So we got the quantum helmet. That's the easy part.
Um, so we'll make ourselves a quantum helmet. Um, and, let's see, so we have the quantum helmet, we need two advanced circuits, two diamond cables, and a high voltage transformer, and then that. Uh, advanced circuits, glass fiber, high voltage, advanced circuit, okay, stop lighting, there we go, cable, Transformer. There we go. Alright, so we got all the base parts except for the ultimate hybrid. So this is actually going to be the hard part. Uh, I just want to check and make sure it is an ultimate hybrid, and it is. Uh, we're probably going to run out of iridium plates. So that's where I'm thinking we're going to fall short. Um, just because, I mean, iridium plates go pretty quick. So let's take a quick look here. Because these things, these enriched scenarium alloys, are not cheap. Um, so I'm hoping we have enough. We might not, I don't know. Let me just eat real quick. Come on, you can do it, machine. Say you have enough materials. I should probably just have a stock of uranium so I don't have to wait for this. But. Let's see. Uranium dust. Let's just take two stacks of this and throw it off to the side. Um, we also have another compressor back here in the processing room. And it's not doing anything. Sure, let's throw that in there. Alright, so we have some uranium now. Uh, hopefully, it's going to have enough. Working on the irradiant uranium. Try saying that seven times fast. Uh, irradiant uranium's not bad. I think it might have gotten stuck. Because I was adding all those things. Oh, wait. Oh, no. I think it did it. Did it? That's right, two ultimate hybrids in one episode. You guys are spoiled rotten. Alright. So we have, oops, nope, these here, these here, and this here. And that makes the ultimate hybrid solar helmet, or the ultimate solar helmet, not the ultimate hybrid. Um, let's see, so let's craft it. Let's so get it in here. Ultimate Solar Helmet. Bam. You know what's the, the kicker to all of this? It's just going as fancy decoration. That's all it's going for. <laughs> oh, man. So we have quantum suit leggings. And we're about to have the helmet. This helmet here. Is pretty awesome and I'm not even gonna wear it <laughs> um, I do like the power armor just a little bit better uh, because I can make it invisible that's kind of cool and then uh, it's I mean it's it's decently powerful so all right Let's see everything's fully charged and we got a full quantum suit over here we got a full nano suit over here that's fully charged, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. And, hey, that's pretty awesome, I gotta say. So, uh, yeah, guys, I think... Actually, I'm gonna do one thing real quick. I'm gonna move these down one. Um, all the way down. And then, I think that'll be it for this particular episode, guys. Uh, so, don't forget to 
leave a comment, a like, a favorite, a subscription if you really want to. Uh, don't forget to leave some suggestions for what uh, we should do next because weirdly enough, after doing all the stuff that we've done, I am starting to run out of ideas a little bit um, and I don't want to deprive you guys of any entertainment so if there is something you want to see me do on here, you know, leave a leave a comment about it. Um, I'm gonna fix this wall real quick. And I'm gonna fix that. And then we're gonna put the materials up above these guys. Because it looks a little better. Alright guys. So that's going to be everything for me today. Uh, like I said, don't forget to leave a comment on what you guys want to see me do next. My name's Krusty Mustard, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye!